Flannery has only been in the job a little over a year, and as of last week, GE shares have fallen to a nine-year low. General Electric announced $23 billion in non-cash charges for its ailing power business. That's a particular point of frustration by board members and stakeholders as low growth has plagued the power arm of the industrial giant. As the company has struggled in the last decade in value after 2009, there's been a steady decline in shareholder confidence. Last June, GE was kicked out of the Dow Jones Industrial Average, one of the longest serving components of the blue chip index for 111 years. With stock prices on the way up, H. Lawrence Culp will fill the role immediately. I'm Colin Mayfield reporting WLWT News 5.